Hi, everyone. This is Dr. Sarah Nasir. I am a family medicine specialist, subspecializing in addiction medicine. Today, I am bringing you a DA public safety alert regarding fentanyl use combined with xylazine. Xylazine street name is Trey, and it is now showing up as a mix with the fentanyl that's being sold on the streets. The CDC data is indicating that from the time frame of August 2021 to August 2022, about 107,000 Americans died from drug poisoning. 66% of those, which is about 71,000 Americans, died from synthetic opiate use like fentanyl. So xylazine is a class of alpha-2 agonists like a blood pressure medicine called clonidine. So it crosses the blood-brain barrier and works in the central nervous system. Normally, it is used in non-human mammals like horses and cattle, and it is a medicine used to induce sedation, anesthesia, analgesia, which means pain control and muscle relaxation. What is happening at this time is that the patients who are using fentanyl on the streets, unbeknownst to them, this fentanyl can contain xylazine. And so when they are injecting the fentanyl into the skin, it is causing what is called skin necrosis. It means rotting of the skin. And this can lead to amputation. And how is this coming into America? According to CDC, the chemicals that are giving rise to fentanyl is being brought over from China to Mexico from where drug cartels like the Sinaloa and the Jalisco are then bringing this into the U.S. and into the hands of Americans causing these overdoses. This is an important information for healthcare providers also to keep an eye out for. The art of medicine is finding the balance between the harm and the healing. Stay safe out there.